Today I've got a really short video for you guys because I'm going to be talking about Puzzle Dipon. Puzzle Dipon was released in 1995 by Visco and weighs in at an incredible, mind-blowing, earth-shattering 30 megs. Okay, so yeah, it's a really small card. This game is basically a homebrew version of Puzzle Bobble or Bust a Move depending on where you're from but with a slightly tweaked objective and easier overall gameplay. You need to free an object that's surrounded by colored gems from the playing field. In order to do that, you have to move a special dial launcher on the bottom of the screen, which you then use to throw a gem towards the top of the field. Match three light-colored gems together and they disappear. Free the object and presto, you've cleared the stage. It's as simple as that. If I called the gems Bubbles, this would be a, the exact same game as Puzzle Bobble, except that in that game you have to clear all the bubbles and after a short period of time the bubbles would lower to the bottom of the screen. Here no additional gems are added, making the game much, much easier. Although there is a time limit of 90 seconds, so it's not a total cakewalk. In total there are 39 levels. To mix things up just a bit, there are a few bonus items like the arrow, which allows you to see the trajectory of your gems, and the star, which destroy all the gems of the same color. In two-player mode, the objective remains exactly the same, to clear the object before your opponent does, however, if you play better than your opponent, you can add additional lines of gems to the top of the screen, thereby forcing your opponent to work faster before their screen fills with gems and ends their game. The audio-visual presentation is decent, but you can clearly see why this game is only 30 megs. It looks good, but nothing overly special, and the same can be said about the audio. It's a fine game, but I'd really recommend you go for Puzzle Bobble over this. Puzzle to Pun is a fun game in its own right, and thankfully can be had for really under $20 sometimes, but Puzzle Bobble is really where it's at. If you're already a fan of Puzzle Bobble and you're looking for something else to add into your Neocab, well then go ahead and give this one a try.